Hey guys, in this short vlog, I want to answer a question that was put to me recently. Should you be learning Python 2 or Python 3? Just so you know, there are two versions of Python. Python 2, Python 3. Python 2, at the time I'm recording this video in November 2016, Python 2 is at 2.72, I believe, version 2.72. And basically, the 2x branch, meaning 2.7 branch of Python, is essentially in maintenance mode. You will not see any new developments there. The action is with Python 3. At this time of writing, it's at 3.2, I believe, 0.5. And if you haven't purchased any books or purchased any courses yet, I would concentrate on Python 3 because that's the future. All the new stuff is going to be coming out in Python 3. And so why did they come up with a Python 3 when they already had a, a Python 2? Well, I guess the Python people thought that there was some core aspects to the language that had to change. So they decided it needed a whole new version number. When you look at apps, you look at programming languages, when you see a whole new version number, you see, go, when you see, for example, Python going from 2 to version 3, as opposed to going from 2.1, 2.2, 2.3, when you see those point, point 0.1, point 0.2, point 0.3 incremental ch changes in an app and in a programming language, what you're typically seeing there are some small additions and bug fixes, that kind of thing. But when you see it goes from a whole new version from a 2 to a version 3 of Python, that's a big change. Something profound is going on there. Like if you look at uh, um, OS 9 in, in the Apple world, I'm going back several years, OS 9 was uh, a, radical, a totally different code base. So when they went to OS 10, it was brand new. So they said it wasn't 9.2, to go, you know what I mean? It was, we got to go to 10 now because it's totally different. And that's what you see with uh, Python. Python 3 is very different from 2 in certain respects and core aspects. And Python 2 apps, several of them, will probably won't run rather on Python 3, although there are conversion scripts that allow you to convert them. But just so you're aware, there are still lots of Python 2 stuff out there, apps, libraries that won't run on Python 3. So that's why I guess they keep Python 2 around for those older apps. And uh, yeah, so, if you're starting new, you should definitely just jump into Python 3. But if you're learning Python 2, don't worry. Python 2 is not so different in terms of the core language. There's just a few differences here and there. So if you learn how to code in Python 2, when you move to Python 3, you may have to, you're going to have to change some, some things in the code here and there. But uh, it will take you like half an hour to learn the differences. So. Don't worry about it. If you're learning Python 2, you're fine. You'll be fine getting into Python 3. But if you haven't started learning Python, just jump into Python 3 because that's where Python is and that's the future of Python. Ciao, ciao.